Okay, guys, um, I know that I've read on the internet that you can find exhaust leaks with a vacuum and some soapy water, and I feel like sometimes that's a rehearsed thing, like they already kind of find where the leak is and then re-emphasize it by running the vacuum again. So, completely unrehearsed, I have an exhaust leak in my 79 FJ40. Uh, the previous owner had put a brand new exhaust system on it and I know these things have a tendency of leaking around the exhaust manifold where it bolts to the head. So um, I'm going to see what we got here. I'm going to turn the vacuum on. It's on exhaust so it pushes air into the system to pressurize it. Then we're going to squirt some soapy water around the exhaust manifold and where the downpipe connects to the exhaust manifold. And if we don't see anything there, we're going to move down the system, which I'm sure normally you may start at the back with the hopes that it's some connection along the way. But just the way this thing pops when I accelerate under a load, I'm assuming it's somewhere in the exhaust manifold. So here we go. Turn the vacuum on. Give the system a second or two to pressurize. I'm going to first feel. Um... Seems like I can almost hear something around. I can feel like a, I can feel something on this side of the uh, exhaust manifold. I, I, I think it's somewhere I'm going to get in, in this area. I feel more to the layer. So, here we go. We're going to try it real quick. Let me get my filthy water. Just simply dishwashing liquid and water. Probably not, obviously, not a 50 50 mix, but I'm going to try to get through and see what it is. Hold on. Possibly coming out between the exhaust manifold and the intake manifold, and you can see what seems to be coming out. Uh, definitely between the intake and the exhaust. So, um, not to say that there wouldn't be more links, but it's leaking out all the way around that connection. So, with that being said, it looks like I'll be taking off the intake and exhaust manifold and I'll give you a much better look at that. You can kind of see the two bolts together. Uh, definitely leak in there. So it looks like I'll be putting a gasket between the intake and the exhaust manifold and hopefully that'll fix it. So there you go. The method does work uh, unrehearsed and not quite what I had hoped for, but I guess I could go ahead and just check. Uh, I don't see anything. I'm trying to get a better view for you guys. Uh, yeah, you can see that head bolt. So obviously the whole system, the intake is a problem and the gasket between that. So let me just, the actual connection surprisingly between the exhaust manifold and the downpipe doesn't seem to be the problem. It's more the, more the uh, intake manifold gasket and the gasket between the intake and the exhaust manifold. So, with all that being said, uh, okay guys, I'm going to start with that and I will update you if it needs more.
Thanks, and good luck with your own lake. Bye.